On the Mont Lake Cut, a well-worn metal dock is unmoored, preparing to make way for a new dock. Sounds fairly routine, right? But this is a big deal. We're getting our new dock. Yay! These docks, um, both the old one and the new one, are really the lifeline to our work. APLUW scientists and engineers spend a lot of time out on the water, rigorously testing sensors, instruments, and platforms that will ultimately be deployed in the world's oceans to conduct sponsored research. Since the 1950s, a metal dock under the University Bridge has served as APLUW's home port. Now, the end of that era. We're here for a once-in-a-lifetime event. Uh, we took the dock of 70 years out yesterday. After decades of service, the old dock was towed away to a salvage yard to be recycled, clearing the way for the new dock, seen as a vital component of APLUW's future. We can't go to the ocean if we don't test our equipment. We can't test the equipment if we don't have boats and we don't have docks. So this is really part of our commitment to the design to deployment uh, philosophy of the lab. It was a long haul that led to this important upgrade. We never thought this day would come. We have been going through a three-year process to actually make this happen. It took 18 months of permit work. The new dock is designed to be safer than the old model. It features an improved shore-to-dock connection, better lighting, an upgraded electrical system, plus increased load-bearing capacity to accommodate larger-scale equipment onto APLUW's research vessels. The great thing about this new dock is it has expanded capabilities. It's going to be so much safer for our research teams. And it's going to be a much more useful platform as we deploy and go into the field. 